Welcome viewers, you are watching Soft Academy. Camera P6 allows the scheduler to model the complexity of activity tasks while maintaining the simplicity of the Gantt charts. This is done while using Primavera P6 steps function. Activity steps allow the scheduler to break down an activity into smaller units of work that will assist in making a status of the activity when the project starts. So we go for the activity steps. In the bottom layout portion of the screen, I will click on steps tab. Then I will just click on the right here and I will just customize here activity details. And from here, I have added steps here. So now I will just go here and I will customize the activity steps. Before it will be in your computer, it will be all the steps are given here. So what I will do, I will add this one all here and I will just click OK. So while we are putting here in steps, first we will go for the project. And in the project, we will just go for the calculation and we will select the project here and we have to just go here for the, you can see activity percent complete based on activity steps. I will just write and we just mention this one to be click OK. So all of the identity physical percentage complete values will be recalculated from the steps. Do you wish to continue? So I will wish to continue. So when I go, will go here. In the activity steps so i i will go here in the column and i will just find here percent complete performance percent complete here so we have already added performance percent complete here we can use this one so also we will go here for general and in here general we will change this one into physical so all the progress should be calculated by physical method. So here I have created Excel sheet and I have also calculated the weightages of the activities and their steps and I have also write the name of activity steps in the templates. This, this, this file is available in my description and you can use it. So first I will copy the mobilization of equipment. So here you can see step weightages. So for step weightages this one is 0.3 one is 0.7 it's up to your project cost so here you can see 30 percent and 70 percent so here is a complete ratio for example your mobilization is complete you can click this one you can see 30 percent okay and when I, when I will click 100 percent will be okay here you can see 100 percent performance percentage is completed when I check these two box so what I will do, I will add this one into template. So I will just click both one and create a template from for them. And I have a name for this template. This one is a mobilization. So here also I have added a template. When we go for template, you can see I have here added a mobilization. And this template is for all users. You can create 110 projects in your field. You can create a lot of templates for the, for yourself. Now I will go for another activity. That one is procurement. So for procurement, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So what I will do, I will just copy the steps here. So here I have added a six steps here. Now I will add weightages from here. So here you can see the weightages. I have put here a weightages. So it's what actually I have put it here. It calculated the steps percentage here. You can see. So the same when I will just click here completed, you can see it's 10%. And just I will just select all and I will create a template and I will name the template into 
procurement. You can this you know, use this template to all your projects. When you're adding your procurement activity, you can add this one. So here I have signed site clearance, survey work, and marking layout. The weightage is 0 0.25, 0 0.4, 0.35. So here I have added layout of form work, scaffolding work, carpenter printer work, and inspection work. So I will assign the percentages. I will just add a create a template and I will just name a template to form work and I will move forward for the reinforcement. Now I will go for the final phase. Before final phase, I will just add a create template here and I will just name the template with a reba work. And the final one, I will go for a concrete work and I will add a step here for concrete work. And there are four steps for concrete work. So here I have added the final weightages and I will just press shift and the click and I will just create a template and with the name of complete work. So I have just pasted here. So now I have just created a mainly steps here. What I will do, I will go forward and enforcement of floor. I will just add from template and I have there rebar and I will add here form work of floor. I will add form work. Now I will go for concrete work, I will add concrete work, a reinforcement of column, I will add reba work, then I will go for form work, then I will go for casting and concrete work, and there is also a form work again, reinforcement, I have a rebar here, casting, I have a concrete work here. So you can add the same as it is throughout the project. When I will go for here, and I want to add here, any progress I mean, when I will click here and it will be automatically assigned to the activity. So today what we have gained from this video that activity steps is a very powerful function in Primavera Basic to provide a greater detail to tasks without having to insert multiple activities in our Gantt chart to define that task. You can see we don't have added any task, any task in the activities but what we have just separate the activity into steps so we can easily update our progress and we can go deeply and precisely and we can go a very smaller to every weightages of every activity. We can also assign here a progress, for example, I can assign here 20%. So 20% it will calculate and it's 35.56. So I, I will also calculate here a 10% here. So you can see it's a 40%. You can see the changes here. So thanks for watching my video. If you don't subscribe my channel till now, please subscribe and press the bell icon. Bell icon. Thanks for watching my video and don't forget to share it to your friends.